Hey guys, this is Toner, and today it's, I don't know, I guess it's kind of, uh, it's kind of like a mixture between like an apology plus, you know, talking about speculation and stuff like that. As you guys know, I like to speculate the f about the future of the game. Sometimes things pay off and sometimes they don't. Before we get into that though, I do want to ask you guys, what do you guys think of the beard? Uh, <laughs> no, uh, so we made this video, you know, like, uh, nine days ago, we were talking about, you know, the fact that there's potentially a new game mode coming. And I did say confirmed there, which I think was probably, you know, not the correct verbiage I should have said. Um, in my opinion, I thought it was confirmed, but from what I can tell, I think it was actually pushed back more so than, you know, nothing coming. Because as we talked about in the actual video, every single, you know, X.0, there is some big new feature. Uh, we've talked about this previously as well when patch 6.0 came out that originally... Cosmic Crucible, I believe, was meant to launch with that patch and then ended up getting pushed back a little. And then that ended up being, you know, but we still had like, you know, the saga, uh, not the saga, the scourge has come out that patch. However, from what I can tell, I don't believe there is going to be something, you know, big and new and exciting next patch, which is a bit unfortunate. Um, a little bit unfortunate. I'm, I'll talk about why I think this is. So yeah, we did this video here. Um, we talked about why we thought that that was going to be, well, why I thought it was going to be, which is there's going to be a patch 7.0 coming in March the 15th. So that is one, two and a half, two and a half, two and two days away from where we are at the moment. So that's not too far away at the moment, um, which is, you know, uh, it's, a bit unfortunate because that means that, you know, we would have had news. I think that's the big thing here that I wanted to say is that if there was something big coming next patch, most likely we would have had news about it by now because of the fact that, you know, it's only two weeks away. Um, which makes me think that two things. First of all, one, the new legendary is not coming next patch, which is unfortunate. I do think that that was pushed back as well. And two, obviously, as we said, most likely not a new um, release thing here. Now, what makes me think that? Uh, one, because we haven't had news. And two, because we had this strike time. This strike time here, um, and I, I think a lot of people thought it was incredibly disappointing. I thought it was great, but that's because I'm someone who was like, you know, I love hearing about how they go about the game, how they go through the game and stuff like that and how they build the game and like different little tidbits. Like when Ciara was saying about how they had to go in and edit all the sound files because the male shield medic skin was doing the female shield medics, um, death animations and stuff, which I, I, I personally like that kind of stuff. I like hearing that kind of stuff. Um, the other thing is that, you know, like th there was nothing announced in this one which I think is the big thing here. Yes, it's the fifth anniversary, but every single time we have a strike time, there is usually some kind of big announcement. Let's have a look back through the strike times because I think that that's kind of important. Uh, where's playlist strike times. So obviously we had this one here. We had the final Apocalypse Saga here, which was announcing, you know, Apocalypse and his requirements and his kit and stuff like that. We had the Unlimited X-Men here announcing um, all the different Unlimited X-Men going into death on Gambit and stuff and those kinds of characters and kind of going in more of that. The Scourge events had their own. We had, like, you know, there's usually at least some kind of announcement. This one here, though... The announcement was, you know, the Kestrel costume, and we got to see the male shield medic stuff, and that was it. That was it, which is, you know, pretty disappointing, because um, usually there is some kind of announcement. Now, I, as I said before, I liked it, personally, um, but... The fact that there was nothing in it makes me lead, led to believe that there was meant to be something in it because of the fact that, you know, there's usually some kind of announcement here. Now, now, so wh where does this bring us? Um, there is most likely going to be something next patch, I would say, instead of this patch. Now, the other thing to keep in mind is that there will be some kind of character or rework or some kind of announcement at the end of this week. Because wh why do I think this? There is exactly two blogs between now and 
when the new patch comes out. If there is at least two teams announced, you know, two teams getting reworked or whatever, they will usually have at least two blogs announcing that kind of stuff. Um, sometimes it's only the week before, but usually it's at least two weeks before uh, to kind of go in depth on that kind of thing. So most likely, I would say most likely, I'm not going to say definitely anymore. Most likely there'll be at least some kind of character announcement. Now, what do I expect? I think that's probably the number one thing is that people will probably ask me is, Torna, what do you expect to be next patch? There's kind of... Two different things that I'm expecting now. I do think that the um, the legendary that was meant to come is most likely pushed back, as we said. Now, that makes me think that there's going to be one reworked team plus uh, new characters and stuff. So, I think there's going to be a rework to Pim. Rework to Pim, next patch, in my opinion. And then... And then, Secret Avengers. Buffing up these Secret Avengers to bring them back into the meta. Now, obviously that means we've got, you know, the bio and the tech gear. Uh, we've talked about this. Uh, where did I put that one? In here. We talked about this. The bio and then this patch is tech, um, which means that, you know, there should be something bio and tech. That means Pim Tech is bio and tech. Um, I don't think there's going to be any kind of MCU tie-ins. I think that Pim Tech will be the MCU tie-in. And I think that the reason that, you know, I, I, at least that's in my opinion, maybe. We'll see. Um, I think a Pim Tech rework would make sense next patch. And I do think that, you know, a, the, uh, filling out those sk secret Avengers. Those were the two kind of rumors that we heard. So that's what I'm kind of sticking with. But let me know down in the comments what you guys think. That's it for today. Have a good day. Goodbye.